everyone talking about Leather in Armagnac by Sense of Wood. The notes in this are black pepper, cardamom, lavender, green violet, leatherwood, cypriol, gurgeon, atlas balsam, vetiver, and guyac wood. So way different than I expected on a couple levels. First of all, I love Sense of Wood. They're, you know, definitely I would say probably one of my top 10 fragrance houses in terms of consistently really thinking like, wow, that smells really high quality, unique, like I really like it, stuff like that. I think there's only been one that I actively disliked. And even then it was just about my taste in those notes. Um, they've generally managed to take notes I don't like and turn them into stuff I do. <laughs> but here it's a little bit opposite. So what I was hoping for out of this looking at the notes was, yeah, like a nice leather with like a bit of spice and toasted quality and kind of mix. I really like what Violet does when it interacts with leather. It creates this really nice, almost like airy accord or something, but I don't get kind of anything that I was hoping for out of this, but that's not to say it's bad, just didn't serve what I was looking for. It's very like dry toasted woods, a la notes like cedar, guyac wood, but Usually I like Ayak wood, um, Australian sandalwood, that type of thing. Not that all of those are in there, but that type of scent. I didn't see sandalwood even listed in this, but it definitely has some similarities with Santal 33. Not that it's a dupe, always necessary to say that before somebody, you know, jumps in saying like, can't believe you compared it to that. But I did look at Fragranica and saw that other people had voted. This reminds me of Santal 33 too. So apparently I'm not totally alone in that. I even get some of that kind of dill vibe from it. Not nearly as much leather as I was hoping for. I honestly barely pick up any leather. Maybe you would get something different from it, but for me, it's just not really coming out. Um, by the dry down, there's kind of a rootsy vetiver that comes out more, at which point I do like it a bit more. But it always has that kind of dill, cedar, sandalwood smell to me. Um, smells high quality, but I wouldn't call it unique whatsoever, especially not compared to other sense of wood scents. Uh, leans masculine to my nose. And yeah, this isn't, there wasn't much reviews or ratings of this on Fragranica yet, so I can't really compare what other people got for mo from a lot of longevity and projection, but when I tried it on skin, it was like too much room. Even this, I have a bunch of different samples sitting out here. This, I've dipped in the fragrance thing many hours ago, and the whole room smells just like that dill, <laughs> sandalwood type of smell. Um, so yeah, this is a no for me, but I guess if you like it, it would definitely seem to have a good longevity and projection. Um, I will link in the description where you can get a bottle or a sample.